Okay, so, like most of us, I have developed a shopping addiction during lockdown. So, I thought I'd show you what I have bought over the course of lockdown. Because I guess lockdown's kind of over now because most people are going back to work. Most places are opening again, you know. Um, looks like it's coming to an end. They're all from various different shops. Um, yeah. That's all really, is that what you're saying in the intro? I've never done a haul before, so. <laughs> Sorry if I'm awkward. Okay, so first one is sort of like accessory type things that I don't need to like get changed for. Because what's the point of doing a haul if you don't try the stuff on? Like, okay, so first are these two rings that I got. I'm wearing them right now. They're from Bo Boho Moon. This one here was £10. Um, just a cute little butterfly like diamonds in it's kind of not focusing properly but like whatever and then this one was a five pound like a cute little star that's the best we're gonna get so yeah just start off those those two bits that i picked up from boho moon like i said pretty inexpensive um I got some room from there like last year and they haven't, what's the word, on green, what's the word, that word, they haven't done that yet, um, so yeah they're pretty good quality, especially for the price, like, I've got some stuff from Lucy and Yak, now, these are the only things I got from there because um, this was at the end of my shopping and I'm trying to cut down on the amount of things I buy, so. First of all, we have this bag, pretty cute, you know, like an orangey colour, I like to wear it like this because it like sits quite well, wait, can you see? <laughs> so yeah, it sits quite well on like my height, so it has this pocket here at the front that you can see, and then it has a pocket inside here, and then like a big bit here. Which I have my person at the moment. It was, I want to say £18. But to be fair, it's good quality. Um, it is more casual because if you look at like the size, it like looks like kind of shoelace. Like the strap. But I kind of like it. It makes it look kind of vintage -y, you know. I think that's the kind of vibe that Lucy and Yak go for for a lot of their stuff. And then there's this belt. Which is like one of the like... I like called seatbelt buckle, but this hasn't got a seatbelt buckle. It's got like one of these things. One side's just plain pink. It's like a pinky purpley colour. And the other side has the logo on it. The Lucy and Yak logo. I think this was £14, I want to say. I didn't do it up tight enough. I also did it up wonky. Bear with. Why is everything I do such a mess? Okay, so I didn't do it up tight enough, but this is like the overall vibe of it really. It needed to be like this, to be honest. Um, then there's, you just get this bit like dangled down, you know, cute. You've probably all seen these bags before, but just wanted to chuck it on quick. Okay, so I got this jumper from Skinny Dip. It's part of um, Sophie Does Life. She used to be called Sophie Does Nails on YouTube. Part of her collection with Skinny Dip. Um, I got it in a large because the medium was sold out. Um, I'm pretty sure that they are doing a restock at some point. I don't know if that will be before or after this video goes up. But if it is still available, I will try to link it down below if I remember. Because it's in a large, it's like really nice and oversized. I just really like the design on it. Like. Have, I've never seen something like this. It's just so cute with the flowers and the sun. Mwah. 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 Next thing is probably my favourite. Everybody knows my friend M. Well, okay, maybe you don't. But she's been in a lot of my vlogs. I speak about her and her art all the time. She's Emma Temps Art on Instagram and she also has an Etsy store which I will link down below. She sells prints and stickers. Oh wait, in the background, there, like by the mirror here, all of these are done by her. And there's also a like space one. Wait, there's also this, 
which I'm pretty sure she painted on a jacket or painted something like that on a jacket and is selling on her Etsy. So if you want that, go get it. it basically, it is this. It says on it, send me a star to say hi and goodbye and hello again, which is a lyric from If I Build a Home on the Moon, my picture this. Basically, to get a jacket, you just DM her on Instagram or Twitter. I literally just said, I want that lyric and I want a moon on there somewhere. And she painted two different designs. I said, I like this one. She painted it on, sent it out. Like, I think it only took, from when I first messaged her, I think it only took about three or four days, maybe five days. Um, she's very communicative. Communicative? She like keeps you in the loop. So like at every stage, she'll take a picture and be like, are you happy with this? Is there anything you want me to change? So don't worry about anything like that. She's also lovely, one of my best friends. Love you, Em, if you're watching. Yeah, this is a men's medium. So it's like nice and oversized. I'll show you a bit like the back when it's on. This might be easier for you to see it. And yeah, I love it. It's one of my favorite things. I'll link her Etsy down below if you want to buy stuff. Ignore the mess in the back. I did tidy, but my sister likes to like, she likes to rearrange where things go. And at the moment, all that stuff apparently belongs on the drawers. I just don't want to have a fight with a four year old. So next thing is this top I'm wearing right now. It is a cute little, is it called lettuce hem? Like at the bottom of her, so it has the lettuce hem. So self love on it. I'm pretty sure I got this in a 10. Wait, let me check. It's really stretchy, so you could size down if you wanted to. It says self love on it. It's got these really cute little hearts on it. Um, yeah, it's really comfy. It is a little. Actually, maybe it isn't see through. When I wore a white bra with it yesterday, you could see the white bra through it. Maybe it's because it's a white bra, because I have like a brownie nudie kind of colored bra on now and you can't see it so yeah maybe go for like a nude bra if you're wearing a bra um i did also wear it without a bra and you can't see your nipple through it so oh wait did you even say who this is from it's from minga did i say that next thing is these jeans yeah they're just like normal mum jeans really um i have to... that kind of shows you the fit on the leg i had to roll them up at the bottom because I'm kind of sure that's good if you're taller than me because it means you can wear them and they won't be too short for you. I wore them up about three times. The jeans I got on Depop, but I'm pretty sure the brand is Pull and Bear. But yeah, I don't know if they're still on the website because obviously I got them from Depop. But I do really like fitting these because they fit like perfectly around the stomach area, you know? Time to get changed to my next top. This is the next top. This is just a cute puff sleeve top. This feels like crinkled, which is good because it means it's stretchy. <sighs> Why am I so out of breath? I literally feel like I've just run a marathon, but all I did is change my top. Um, kind of a problem. Um, yeah, obviously I wouldn't wear this bra, but I'd probably go for a strapless bra, to be honest. Um, or no bra, I guess, but because it's like crinkled, I don't know if that would irritate, you know, the area. <laughs> um, this is from I saw it first. Sleeves are long, you know, baggy. I really like these sleeves. I've just got it with the jeans still, which I think would be quite a cute outfit, you know, if you're going out for drinks. I like the possibility that you could go out, you know. It's cute though, I love it. I haven't went out yet, which is why there's tags still on it on the back. Um, because I haven't had anywhere to wear it because like, haven't been anywhere. Actually, I did go out the other day, guys. I saw one of my friends. I went to South Sea, which is like the beach near me, but I went to like the arcades. And then we went to Bingo because, you know, we're cool 20 year olds, so go to Bingo. Okay, next outfit. This top is from I Saw It First. Again, affordable. Even though it actually looks like way more expensive than it actually is it's like high necked has these lovely sleeves which make you feel like a bird or something or like i'm living out my mum i made her dreams on the beach you know like imagine being in greece being like ooh, give me give me give me your bed after midnight you know the 
vibe um this i think i sized down in because obviously it's really baggy anyway so like it doesn't matter it's quite a long top which is why i tucked it in whenever i wear it my sister is always like yeah wear the top with the wings and like i guess this is why it's really like big the only issue is i wouldn't wear it to like a meal or something because these sleeves are pretty easy to like donk or something which is like the action i did there oh no my top's got ketchup on um but it's like quite stretchy yeah this skirt's from mingo it actually has the label here can you see that it's um not too long or too short you know like it has like pink as well as the white and the black checkered which i really like there's also this button here and then there's another button inside like here somewhere so like you're actually secure like because of this part it is like done up over here so it's not going to just open on you um which is nice i really like the chain detail as well like this chain's good quality you can take it off so if you want you can put it on another pair of trousers you have it also has belt loops which everybody loves a good belt loop but this actually i don't need it with this because it's like i got it in a 10 but it's on the smaller side of a 10 so if you are between sizes i would say to size up um just because of my experience yeah it's like on the tighter side and minga do have longer delivery times but like i don't mind it could also be because we are still in a pandemic so maybe in a normal time it wouldn't take a five days i mean i don't know i've never ordered from them before now so who knows next outfit time next outfit time next outfit time I thought I was stuck in this top then and then I almost like cried. But it's fine. False alarm, ladies. Right, this top I again love. Um I need to do the neck up, but like I can't be bothered if I'm honest, so let me just hold it and pretend so you get like the full vibe. Um yeah, it's too cute. It is clear, so I did put this bandeau on with it. Ignore my brush ups. Again, put my throat first. Just thought this would be cute for like something more dressy, I guess. Um, but not like formal dressy. You know, say like an event or like maybe a wedding, maybe at a push. Not like work interview type formal, like more like not business formal. But um, yeah, I just really like it. I don't know when I'll wear it or where I'll wear it. But I just really liked it, so I bought it. <laughs> I didn't tuck this in properly, lol. Let me just hold it. These shorts are from Monkey. Just nice low shorts with a slit. They have like quite big pockets, as you can see. My whole hand fits in them pretty well. Just nice, comfortable, flubby shorts, really. <laughs> so the next one is just this top. Yeah, it's from Monkey again. I've just got it with the same shorts again. It's just a nice cute summer top the neckline's quite low so you know you could pull it up and then more of your stomach is showing so it depends on wherever you drive i have a beautiful stomach just this yellow color with this little floral print on just cute uh not really for this weather because it's kind of gray outside right now but you know when it's sunny to be cute on like a um why am i holding my boobs um <laughs> be cute on like a um like on the beach maybe or like maybe even on a night out you know like this with like jeans or a skirt you know just show off the boobage what am i doing um yeah i like it <laughs> you got it you got it got it you got it you got it. This top is from Monkey. I love it. Like with everything in me. Um, it's got like little holes in it. So I would advise to wear a bra or nipple covers, I guess, because you can see like your nipple through it. Um, yeah, I really like these sleeves. It makes me feel like a princess. Just living out my princess life dreams, you know? Like it feels like Snow White, you know? She's got the puff sleeves on her dress. Like this with like a cute skirt, It'd be like princess vibes. I'm a princess. I would have loved to wear this top in Paris, but it's fine. We won't talk about Paris. We won't talk about Paris because it didn't happen. 
I'm off to write in Dublin instead. Well, I'm in a pub in Dublin. <sighs> Not quite the same vibe, but... Um, what have I even said? Uh, this top for monkey, great, love it. I'm wearing a different pair of shorts. Like jogger shorts, really. Um, they look really tight, but they're not actually that tight normally. Um, yeah, I don't know what this brand is. What does it say? La Gear. I got this from Sports Direct. They were two for twelve pounds, so I got these one. No, two for nine pound. So I got these ones, and I got a grey pair. But yeah, they're just chill for just sitting in the house when it's too hot to move and I also work out in them so yeah they're like jogger material but a bit thinner than joggers you know joggers only have the fleece you don't have the fleece so second to last outfit is a dress last outfit is also a dress I don't like it with such pain I haven't tied this up can I even do it one with one hand let's see shall I I swear this was tied up because I can get too worn this so um Ow! Okay, I can't tie it up. I don't know how I did it before, but I can't do it. Oh, fuck me life! Oh, I think I'll use my mouth. Wait, wait, is this one? No, no. No, no. You got it. No, no, you got it. Britt's got talent, here I come. Okay, yeah, so this dress so cute i've actually worn it once like i just said it's just got this like square neckline with like cute puffy sleeves again it's like fairly supportive without a bra i just prefer to wear a bra just because my boobs are different sizes so you can't tell as much if i have a bra on because they're like about the same amount rather than one being down here and the other one being here it's not that extreme i exaggerated um but yeah this is just a cute little summer dress these little cute flowers. I think it's called Ditsy Flower Floral Print, which is the same as the yellow top as well. Um, it's on Motel Rocks. Again, Motel Rocks' sizing is, again, a bit of a weird one. This is in a medium and it fits perfectly, but it said a medium is meant to be a size 12. And I'm usually a size 8 to 10, so I'd say size up. It's, it's nice and thin, floaty, airy, summery, you know? Um... The delivery was quick as well. I think this actually came next day and I paid for normal delivery. So I didn't pay for next day delivery or anything. My brain, can you tell I'm losing brain cells? Like, I actually don't know how to function like a normal human anymore after being stuck inside for four months. Has it been four months? It's July now, isn't it? Wow, like flowy, so it like comes out here. Like this is my ribs, and then my hips are here. And then like goes out, but it flares out more than my hips are because my hips are there. That's what it would be like if it was tight, but it like flares out, like kind of skatery, and it's kind of like mid thigh, like because my knees are picnic vibes. It was actually um, it was actually Sophia and Chintzia that made me want to buy a dress like this because they kept saying like frolicking in the fields with the cute dresses on, and I was like. Ugh. I want a frolic in fields too, so I bought two. Last outfit time. I think this is my favourite dress out of the two. I haven't worn this one yet because I feel like it's less casual because there's a little bit boobage. The main reason I got it was the colour, I'm not gonna lie. Purple is my favourite colour, so I was like, yes, a lilac dress, let's go, girls. But this will look really cute, it's on docks. I don't have docks, but just throwing out ideas into the universe. Docks and a denim jacket you right i like how like it sits on your boob and this part you can like tighten as tight as you want or you can make it looser if you want more boobage showing i quite like it like that to make it more conservative you know you don't want to give too much away got to keep the boys guessing or the girls i'm not assuming anyone's sexuality here darlings yeah the sleeves are like quite short i wonder will they look good like off if that's your vibe it looks cute but I think I prefer them up. So this one's like slightly tighter, like as you can see, this is it like skin tight and that's like less flowy. And at the bottom also has this part like, wait, it's like kind of like, there's a seam here. So it kind of like frills out slightly. 
I don't know how well you can tell that, but yeah, it makes it like go out a little bit. I don't know. I like the shape it gives it. Again, it's like a similar length to the other one. Um, if you're taller than me, it will be shorter. So if you're looking and you're like, mm, that's a bit too long for me, then try it because you know you're probably taller than me. But I quite like the length because I get paranoid, especially with floaty stuff. If it like it's windy and it's like woo, I'm like ah, you know. Yeah. Again, this is from Motel Rocks. Did I say that? Motel Rocks. They also have this in top form, this dress, which I did buy first, but. It didn't fit right on me and the zip was a bit weird, so I sent it back. But yeah, I think that's all I have to say about my clothes. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the thumbs up button. I never say that, but you know, it should be a given. This was a different video for me. I've never done anything clothing related, fashion related. But if you like videos like this, definitely give it a thumbs up but to keep signing petitions guys black lives matter is not a trend it is a movement also educate yourself on everything else going on right now like stuff in palestine poland argentina literally name a country that's probably something dodgy going on there stay safe stay healthy wear a mask when you go out in public guys come on you know it's not just for your safety it's also for the safety of others and yeah i'll see you again soon with another video oh whoa. oh whoa. oh yeah